Coconuts, you know, stand for leisure and exoticism and place and travel, and my mind started wandering, thinking about the possibilities of what I could do with it. So that's how I sort of ended up thinking about making images with a coconut. So I started off by making um, photograms, um, faces out of the coconut. I didn't know that they would be like funny at the same time. So I basically punched a hole through, I guess, the mouth of the coconut face, drained it, sawed a coconut in half, uh, took out all the meat, cleaned it out, let it dry in the sun for a little while. And then when I do the exposure, um, I sandwich a piece of photographic paper in between the body and then there's a piece of tape over the mouth and I just open it and I do the exposure and I close it after the light hits it. And then in the dark room, I just process the paper. I use coconut water in the development of the images, so I mix it with the chemistry and seeing if it will react in some sort of way, so using the actual object throughout the process of making the image. It's something that you don't really have a lot of control over in terms of uh, clarity and focus, and it's a lot of experimentation, so uh, the images behind me um, are the ones that I thought were more successful in terms of finding the bridge between uh, the mood and the tone of all of the images together. I think there's um, a lot of humor in the work that I do as well, and I think that building a selfie stick and mounting a coconut onto the end of it um, and taking it to tourist destinations, you know, is an absurd gesture to do, but I also think that it comments on how um, we're obsessed with um, place and how we use objects and how we photograph in this day and age.